Good morning, folks. Morning of day six. Getting ready to leave the Mount, Mount Laguna Lodge. Um, I, it is what it is. It's a hiker hiker place. I mean, obviously families come here for vacation, but I got a motel room, which I'm sure they just keep the hikers in. There's several like cabins around. They're supposed to have four beds, so I'm sure if you had a group of hikers, they put you know, go in there. But no frills, not real clean. Um, if you don't have to come here, I I wouldn't. The resupply isn't very good this year, and it's extremely expensive. Little dollar things of tuna are like three fifty. Same thing, dollar spams three fifty. Um, everything's extremely high. Uh, I had to come here to charge my electronics, and I had planned to. I wanted that five days to have, you know, bed. I just, I just made it a point. That's what I wanted to do. So, like I said, if if you don't have to, I wouldn't. Um, really expensive. The two brothers that are running the place are nice enough, but the uh, the restaurant down the street is being sold, so it's not even doing um, takeout food anymore. They're completely done. The family that's run it for, I think, 29 years, they're gone. Um, so, you know, they had a good run. Unfortunately, this I'm sure it killed them. So uh, I'm going to finish packing up. i got to wait for the store to open so I can check out and get a couple resupply items. I mean, I'm getting like three ramens and a tuna, and that's like it. Um, that, that should definitely hold me well through um, Julian, which I don't even think I'm stopping in, and probably to Warner Springs. So, uh I'm going to get ready to go, and I'll talk to you guys later. Have a good day. Just a beautiful morning.
Well, that's where I'm heading, folks. We got some hikers up ahead of us. I'm gonna see if I can't catch up to them, see who they are. We'll talk to you later. So folks, I just coming down the trail here this way, and I mean, you turn this little bluff here, and look how beautiful this is. I mean, it literally looks like a painting. I'm standing here, and it doesn't look real. And I know this phone can't, can't give it any kind of justification. I mean, this, this is a very stunning view. I mean, literally, it looks like a flipping painting. Wow, that's beautiful. Well, I guess we'll get back down on trail, but... Well. This has got to be one of the best little views out here yet, all around. That is just gorgeous. All right, guys, we'll talk to you later. That's straight out, and that's to the valley. Again, it's just gorgeous out here today. All day up and down around this vista. Beautiful. Gorgeous scenery here in California, Southern Cal anyways. Got that one little peak over there to do. And then I got a couple thousand feet, I think, of elevation drop. So, well, we'll see y'all later. Well, folks, I don't know how well you can see, but there about that middle peak there, you see the trail coming down right through that middle peak. And then it kind of went down there and around the other one, and then kind of down all the way through there. I don't know how well you can see that. And I thought we were starting our downhill approach, but guess what?
we're going back uphill again. I really thought we were supposed to start going downhill. That's what the map was telling me. Well, that's what the trail goes. It goes up and down, folks. Well, we'll talk to you hopefully at camp pretty soon. Hoping to go about 14 miles, maybe 15. But uh, hopefully we'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye. So right around the corner over there was the uh, Skydivers Memorial there. I don't even try to say the name of the point. But uh, a lot of people around, I try to be respective and just take a few quick pictures of the monument. A lot of people around now. But yeah, this is the trail. It just keeps going. Right down there's the edge. <laughs> Don't trip. I always think this is the cool little thing. I mean, literally one little slip off the edge and, you know, one little stumble on a, on a bad rock and you're right over that edge. And I think we're up about 5,900 feet right now or something like that, so. Ain't gonna stop for a while.
Well, folks, camp is set up again for this evening. Uh, we're in this little tiny knoll of a valley. I still think I'm at about 53 or 400 feet or 5200, something like that. I don't know. I'll be going down all morning when I get out of here, but hopefully there's no seismic activity because we got a lot of rocks around here. Um, yeah, so yeah, there's camp for the night. There's a little bit of a stream here. It's really just leaching through where it's rained for the last several weeks. I'm not worried about any moisture here, but that is my uh, camp for tonight. And then we have right now, I'll bring you to the sun. That's going to blind you. But yep, sun's going to set uh, behind us there and show a beautiful sunrise in the morning. So I did about 13 and a half actual PCT miles today. And so uh, we'll see how tomorrow goes. And you guys have a great day. We'll talk to you later on. Bye-bye.